Hello YouTube and Lego fans, welcome to Destination Lego and welcome to another Lego Technic review. So this is the Hot Rod set 42022. This is for ages 9 to 16. Comes with a piece count of 414 and it currently retails here in the UK for £29.99 from the Lego store or the Lego store online. Okay, so very quick look at the box. Obviously, you can see the front of the box there. If we just spin this around, we take a look at the rear of this box. Um, and this is a two-in-one um, model, um, set rather. So here we can see the alternative um, car that can be built. Um, another thing they seem to be encouraging us to do more, certainly on these LEGO Technic sets, is to build from the instructions online so the digital build okay guys so that's pretty much it for our box okay then just to show you this comes with two sets of instructions so two instruction manuals so we have the first manual there for the actual hot rod which you can see there and we have a second manual for the alternative build uh, which you can see there is this kind of beach buggy um, type of vehicle or sand dune vehicle um, but yeah, two pretty cool sets, but obviously my favourite is without question the Hot Rod. So let's take a close look at the set now. Okay guys, there we go. So there's our first look at the Hot Rod from the LEGO Technic range. Um, I love this set. I've got to say that's my kind of opening statement for this really. I think it does look menacing and really awesome. Um, beginning to come quite a fan of these LEGO Technic sets actually. Um, I will put down the link to the description of this video, um, the Lego Technic mobile crane um, set 42009 I believe it is and that really really is an awesome set so I encourage you to take a look at that one if you haven't done so already so let's take a look at a 360 view of the hot rod. Okay guys so starting off with obviously the side shot I'm just going to obviously now spin this round okay moving into the front of the hot rod Obviously round to the other side. Round to the rear of the hot rod. And finally finishing up back round to that side. Okay guys, one of the functions on this set is you can have the roof up, which you can now see now, and I'll show you how that mechanism works in a second, but I just wanted to give you that same 360 view and how the vehicle looks uh, with that roof obviously in the up position okay okay there we go Okay guys, so the first feature I want to show you is actually that roof mechanism and how that works. Obviously this being a Technic set, it does use the various Technic pieces, the pins, the rods, the cranks. Um, so if we see this piece here, this is what actually operates the roof and that is just a case of simply turning that. So I'm trying to do this without my hand taking too much of the shot. So if I turn that you will see that roof flip back over like so and if you put it back up like that so I just zoom in to show you that a little bit closer okay so there we see it there and again it's this piece here simply turn this and we can see that mechanism there and that roof just flipping over like so Okay, next thing to show you is the engine detail here. Um, this is another one that does have the pistons that go up and down. So you can see those moving up and down obviously as the um, car moves backwards and forwards. Okay, and again if we just zoom in, take a closer look at that engine detail. There we go, and again if I just move that, there you can see those pistons operating. Okay. 
Okay, so next thing I actually want to show you when I'm on this side shot is this sticker detail on the side here because I think it does look pretty awesome. Just zoom that in. If I can just lower this camera a second. There we go. The flame with the skull. Again, pretty menacing and awesome looking. Okay, guys, now looking at the front view, and again, we're just going to zoom in, take a better look at that front shot. Okay, there you go there, you can see there some of that detail and some of the use of the various Lego and Technic pieces. You can see the headlights there on the front, obviously, the radiator grille. And again, looking back towards that engine detail. And they've done a fantastic job on this. And nice, very nice chunky um, tyres and wheels on this set as well. And just remaining on the theme of the wheels, you can obviously see at the rear, um, we have larger tyres um, on the rear wheels as opposed to the front. Um, and again, to give it that hot rod look. So let's just take a closer look at those. See they're the ones at the front and again some great detailing, great use of the pieces and then round to those rear wheels you can see there which are obviously like I said making the use of the larger tyres. Okay so next thing I want to show you how the steering mechanism is operated on the set so if we look to the rear of the vehicle here um, we have this section, or rather this pin here, sticking out the top. We'll take a closer look at that there. Okay, you can just see that piece there, and that is actually how we steer the vehicle. So it's just simply a case of grabbing hold of that and twisting that. And then what that does, let me just zoom out again. As I twist this, you can see those front wheels um, we're obviously connected through the various Technic pieces to operate, so the best way to obviously maneuver this is hold on to that piece, move it along, turn the wheels, and then obviously we can steer and drive the hot rod. Um, so again, great playability on this as well, so not only does it look awesome, the functions on it allow it to be obviously played with as well. So. Great for kids, great for adults, great for SA foals. Um, can't beat Hot Rod, and again, I think it looks absolutely stunning. Okay, guys, just going off the tripod for this bit. I just wanted to show you, Rob's obviously showing that sticker there. We also have some stickers on the rear here. Um, and also just take an opportunity again just to show you some of this detailing. You'll be able to see this better from this angle. So again, there's that Technic piece there. And it is a case again of just simply turning that great mechanism actually, and that just flips the roof up or down. So we do that slower. You can see see the way that works. So well, we've got the roof down inside the vehicle. Um, you can see there are two seats um, in there. I'll spin it around the other way. You can see the steering wheel there, and again you start to see some of the Technic pieces that um, control the various mechanism here, obviously that rear one you can see there is the steering um, so we can see that um, again that engine detail in there, the pistons um, if we again have a little look at that front shot I'm just going to spin this round again so we can see obviously that side shot there ok guys for those that are interested just show you the underside of the vehicle just tip that over like so. so again this gives an idea of the use of some of these pieces and how this is assembled um, again I think these are very clever um, certainly the designers of these various Lego Technic models okay and then just a shot of the rear so we can see again some of that detailing so we can see the rear lights um, there and looking now up the shot looking from the rear back to the front okay guys that's my review of this set complete the Lego Technic Hot Rod set 42002 
So okay guys, let me know what you think of this set and indeed the Technic range. Please do give me some feedback in the comments section. If you have enjoyed this video, please do go ahead and give it that thumbs up. And again, I encourage you to look down at my review to the LEGO um, Mobile Crane 42009. Um, again, link is down to that in the description to this video. And if you haven't done so already, please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Cheers.